David, I'm sure that's a bitterly disappointing one tonight. How do you reflect on the game here? Um, it's so close. These games are always away games in uh, international football. Are always so tough. The first goal was was always going to be important in the night. Um, probably never played as well with Slovakia, but certainly had enough chances to um, to go in front and and get an equaliser. So we have to put it down to one of those nights. Disappointing me with a chance to to get into that A group of a team. So. A disappointing way to end the campaign. How do you boys reflect on it? Of course, the highs that we've experienced, but of course, this as well. Is it a case of we have come a long way, but we've still got a lot to do? Yeah, I think if anything, it's a reminder of how how um, far we've come and how hard we need to work to be competitive in these games. Um, obviously, as I said, we missed a chance to get into that A group. We're winning the we're winning the the B section, um, but yeah, we have come an awful long way. It's, it's, it's a bit of a strange week in terms of the, the playoff being the first game. Um, we're disappointed with results in the, the other two, but I think as a whole, especially the Slovakia um, game, we played really well. Yeah, considering the run we were on as well, that nine unbeaten, yeah, yeah. to go two on the bounce, I'm sure will be this point. Yeah, yeah. But how important is it to pick up when the international football does return again? Oh, well, definitely. I mean, obviously the draw is um, in December for the World Cup, so we can we can focus on that. We know the Euros is there, um, so we can focus on our three qualifiers. Uh, when the draw gets made, so looking forward to that. We've obviously not got the backup of the, the playoff for the Nations League now, so we need to get off to a good start in March.